What's up guys, Mecco here, got a let's play of Magicka 2, it's finally released on uh, consoles today and I'm so excited, I can't wait to show this off. I've already passed this chapter as you can see because I got my white robes, I've got my mallet and all that. So I figured I'd just come back here and show off the basics of all the magic that's in Magicka 2. It's, it's so much dude, there's so much, so much to do. Alright, as you can see it's what to teach us about life, so we're going to learn some life. All right. Put it in our queue here. Now let's see. We can heal around us, like a you know a, an effect around us in case people are standing next to us. You know, and all that, blah blah blah, all that. All right. Now we can add it to our weapon so we can hit whatever we hit is going to get healed. Now, now we can finally heal ourselves. You see how it's going up slowly? If we add more, it's going to heal us greater, which is awesome. All right, now, fire. We have some fire up here, but not Q. Gentlemen, like so. Monward. Earth. Get some earth up in this. Let's break down these walls like so. See that rock that flew over there? Want to watch out for that. That kind of hurts. All right, now. Let's see what this is here. Mm. How to spell chapter one. The elements at the bottom of the screen shows you the eight magical elements that can be combined to make spells. Selecting an element will conjure it into a, your spell queue. So we can add fire and earth to get fireball. Back off. There we go. Now this little spot right here is a secret that I had come. I had just come across. So we're gonna come right down here. Ooh. Just like so. Come on down here. Look at all the cheese. Honey. Cheese King, are you cheese? Yes, I expect that you are cheese. Please! Back off! Just a taste! Get off me. There we go. Now, this was a secret spot which gives you the cheese slicer. A tool of the finest quality, worthy of slicing the king's cheese. It might even be made of silver. Low physical damage, low death damage. So that's why I'm not going to use that. I got my mallet right here. Which the mallet is a relatively harmless weapon used to bonk tiny mythical wizards on the Gungan. High physical damage causes not back. So yeah, definitely using that. Let's get the hell out of here and go back to our main quest. Alright, now we're learning water. Add water to our queue and get rid of this fire. Oh, wrong button. There we go. Be gone. Now, if we add earth with water, we get a splash of water. Oh wow, that was way off. That was terrible too. Dang. Alright, there we go, there we go. There is this last bit so it's not so people can cross through here. What do we got up here? Another wizard? Friend, a few of my friends have my returned from the war. I wanted to stay too, but run. someone had to come back to water all the plants. Oh, nice of you, that's nice of you. Alright, now we're learning shield. Add shield to our Q. Now we can add shield to our weapon, which will do that. We'll add shield to. Now we'll do a surrounding effect for others to get inside our shield and be protected. Now let's actually physically put shield on us, just like so. Put it back on us, like so. Yeah, yeah. There we. go. Yo, let's get the hell out of here. If you conjure a water and cold element, you get ice. Thank you for the tip. Oh, yeah. Look at me! Oh, he's drowning. Look, I guess he should have learned to swim before he did that. Look, robes! Kill! Now we just learned death, which is our long range attack. Ooh. 
Goodbye. Explodes. All right, now we're getting cold. We can cast cold over the water so we can proceed. Yeah. Now let's see what the other effects are. Let's see. I guess people around us, we blast around us if we're getting swarmed. We can cast ice on them. Let's see what happens if we put it on t physically on us. Ah. So, I'm frozen as you can see. Now the only way I can get rid of this is to cast fire on myself. Now it hurts, as you can tell, it hurts. So we can just add some life here and then heal ourselves here. Voila. Now lightning, we get some lightning up in this beast. Now we gotta charge these and then open up the door. Like so now what happens if we we can add it to our weapon, like I said. This is cool. Oh. And now we can see what happens if we put it on ourselves. Ow, that that kinda hurts. Alright, we will not do that. Put ourselves here. Like so. Alright. Let's proceed. Vlad! Hello again. I thought I'd expand a bit of your quest. The child of prophecy is in great danger, but we don't know who the child is or what threats her face her face her. <laughs> you must travel to faraway lands and seek Nastriel the South Seer. He will know what to do. If you e if you ever get lost along the way, walking to the right usually does the trick for some reason. It's huh. a good trick. It's a good tip tip. <laughs> Remarkable. The castle is in ruins, but this looks rather well. Ha! That's a lame pun. Who are you guys? A living wizard? Here, you can take this book. We can't read it. Why not? Because we're dead? No, you fool. It's because of socio-economic reasons. <laughs> Such an ass. This change is terrifying to conservative wizards like us. I don't want to listen to you guys. You guys are annoying. Alright, now, so, you get these extra Would you guys shut up? I'm trying to talk to my people here. Alright, we get this... Uh... Alright, so we can use these extra powers, like push. We can get rid of this boulder here. Like so... There are extra powers. It's basically like the power for the Q power cues that we have down below, but they're extras. And there's more to be found. Like, I just got this one. I haven't tested it out, and I wanted to show it off. Hey, one second. Hey, down there. Come here, and I'll teach you how to fight, said Timmy the Training Dummy. Timmy the Training Dummy teaches you how to use your abilities and uh, put magic onto your weapon. Fantastic. Now, take that weapon and hit me as hard with it. Hurry! Now, I'm not going to hit him because I've already done it. Basically, when you knock him out, you get his wooden staff and his wooden sword. Nothing that great. But, we're going to test out this new power that I haven't used yet. Whoa. Now, we also have haste. Can't move around really fast. Ow, that hurt for some reason. Let's proceed. Vlad. Oh, I almost forgot something. It's dangerous to go alone with up to three friends. Take this. See you later. Now, this basically gives me the ability to revive people I use. I can push down revive like let's say if you join my game it'll bring you back to life because you start off dead I have to bring you into my world basically or if you want to feel magical and know all your powers you can add lightning and life which basically is a defibrillator and we can bring them to life just like so Uh -huh. says, how to spell chapter 3. Some elements cancel each other out. For example, lightning and water can never coexist. Neither can life and death. This fact can be used to delete an element from your spell queue if you've conjured a spell that you did not want to use. You know, like you messed up. You can get rid of it. Alright. Well, I think this is about the main of the 
quest here. Yes, it is. Ah, unlocks found 9 out of 10 only. I'm missing something in the tutorial there, you guys. That sucks. Basically, you find stuff that unlock, like, my white robes. I unlock white robes running through there by finding the path or, you know, the cheese slicer. You know, you find all these little artifacts that you can bring along with you for further adventures and stuff like that. It's great stuff, you guys. I hope you guys look into it, and I hope you guys enjoy this video. I hope it gave you all the information you wanted to know about Magicka 2. I really like it. It's going to be a great game. I can't wait to get my friends in here to play. And if you guys want to join me, hit me up. Let me know in the comments below and we'll get something started. We'll get some magic quests going on and doing some awesome shit with magic. <laughs> Alright, well I hope you guys enjoyed this. It's been great. I will see you in the next episode. Y'all have a good one. Peace.